Hey, welcome back to the channel. Um, I want to show you something that has really made my hand routing experience much better and I think a little bit more safer. Um, and this can apply to things outside of obviously guitar building, but currently I have here a, um, this is monkey wood body that I'm working on here. And this, you're like, what is this box? What is this? I'm so glad you asked. Um, this here is a box where my router is in a not use mode. Um, I've seen other people do something similar. Um, for me, I, I'm making this work for guitar building. So anyway, um, as we all know, this is the dangerous portion of this piece of machinery. It can cause a lot of damage. And I want to shield myself from that harm. So what I've done was built this box that when I'm not using it, it's safe. So when I'm going through and I'm making some routes by hand like this, I let it cool down and then I have a nice place to stage this so it's safe. Why you say you put all the time into this? Well, I'm so glad you asked because I use many different bits and I was losing my router bits um, and sometimes too much um, sawdust. So I made a spot where I can put my bits and um, easily find them and easily just, you know, to basically know exactly where they are. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's super simple. Um, there really isn't, I didn't put any type of special um, cutting or dovetailing. I literally just have four pieces for the box and then I have it on a platform. I mean, that's basically it. Um, I didn't feel like I needed to invent something new um, or state of the art. I just needed a place where I could easily put my bits Ah, woo -hoo. Find a place that I can easily put my bits and find them, and then also stage my router when it's waiting, cooling off, you know, because other, otherwise, sometimes on angles and all this other business, I don't want that. I want my router to be bam right there, and my little crude plastic shield helps also to slide around the body so that way it doesn't dip or divot or anything like that. So yeah, um, easy video this week. Um, this really saves me a lot of headache and uh, there's a, I feel a little safer with this. I don't let this, I actually, I don't let the bit run in the box, but once the bit stops, it's just a nice place that you could put your router bit. All right, thanks for stopping by. That's the video for this week. Thank you so much. If you have any modifications or you've got something similar to this that works well for you, um, please comment below. Um, also, if you'd like to help this channel grow, please consider hitting the subscribe and like button and pass it along. Little things like this can really make a difference um, in some woodworking. I know it has for me, and I hope to cover a whole bunch of things um, between jigs and little contraptions like this that really make woodworking and specifically for guitar making a heck of a lot easier. So have yourself a great week and I will see you next time.